Good morning, beautiful and gorgeous beings. Welcome back. Today I'm wearing my, wearing my strong t-shirt because we are strong beings. Absolutely. We are so strong. We don't even notice. We don't even, we don't even realize the power that we already have inside of us. It's only a matter if you decide to actually use it or not. <laughs> so, okay. So now let's talk a little bit about, um, about what I'm planning for the next couple days. So, uh, well, first thing is that uh, I, I'm going to, uh, I've thought a lot about it and everything, and I understand that we have to accept, you know, previous mistakes and stuff like that, but I want to improve on some things, uh, some previous videos I've made, and I'm going to, I've, I've made the actual uh, definite decision to remake uh, two or three of my videos uh, on chakras, two of my videos I'm going to re while remaking them. I'm going to be re-editing uh, re editing them a little bit to make them an only one video and to make them a little bit more complete uh, to my liking uh, just because uh, I'd like to give you guys, you know, the best product I can actually give in that present moment with, uh, with extra information I have. So uh, I'm going to be remaking two videos, especially the one on the third eye. I'm going to be uh, using, you know, my uh, previous clarifications, my first video, maybe edit a little bit, bit of it, and then add it into making it like a whole one video. It's probably going to be across uh, like approximately 30 minutes total, slightly under, and um, and I'm going to have to remake my throat chakra video because I have some very important points I wanted to add that I did not add in my in my first video, and I thought it was very very important to add in my first video. So uh, I'm going to be remaking uh, my throat chakra video. I have all the details all right here <laughs> about all the different stuff I want to add. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it. So I'm going to be remaking these two videos and I have uh, other videos coming up as well. So uh, sending you guys much love, much positivity. Stay strong, right? Stay strong in your life, in your daily life. Face your challenges upwards face your challenges up front and become strong like the being that you are that you are all of you guys are strong strength is a is a mindset it's a state of mind and if you want to increase your strength increase your um your confidence your confidence in being just more up front right Unblocking that throat chakra, speaking your mind, speaking your truth. Well, look up, uh, I'm going to make a whole video on this at some point in the next week or something, but uh, uh, look up mantras, M-A-N-T-R-A, -A, mantra. It's a set of words or, you know, syllables or a set of words or whatever that uh, are technically magical in meaning in the sense that all of the language that we all have, it's always magical. Oh my God, I'm making a whole other video just on this today. <laughs> so yeah, so mantras are pretty good. Uh, then you have, um, you know, practicing daily affirmations for your confidence, right? So every single morning you, uh, you write on the sheet of paper or you read it right before bed, whichever is best for you, right? Uh, for me personally, it's in the morning because <laughs> at night I, I kind of, you know, don't care as much. So that's my trick. I do it when I when I wake up in the morning. I wake up 30 minutes earlier. I watch my whole video on, uh, you know, daily self-affirmations. And then uh, if I want to continue further, I have my own, uh, you know, extra separate sheet with other affirmations that I can read manually to myself while either looking at myself in the mirror or just repeating them out loud. And uh, I keep saying it. You repeat them in the morning when you wake up when you just wake up, that's the best time. Or when you're just, just, just about to sleep. Because your your brain produces some waves, some, some uh, you know, some more relaxing waves when you're about to go to sleep. And for some reason, like, your, your subconscious mind becomes more of a sponge. When, uh, you know, a lot more childlike. Remember child, right? Children, uh, you know, when they're young and everything, they, they kind of like, we say that they're sponges, right? They're sponges of information. They, they will gather, they will remember everything. You can, you can make them learn like a new language super young and they'll learn it pretty quick, right? So that's the power of the subconscious mind and, uh, you know, I guess the more childlike aspect of yourself. And you can explore that. 
you can explore that and actually exploit it to your advantage for your own benefit and not just for your own benefit by the way because when you actually benefit yourself for your own life you you got to see it not in a selfish way so you got to focus on yourself first you focus on your own well-being right and then your own well-being will do that trigger domino effect to people around you. It will just spread like wildfire, right? And then people will get inspired and everything. And then people start to, co you know, copy each other and everything in a good sense, right? Everybody starts to copy each other, copy good habits, stuff like that, right? And then we just improve together collectively. And anyways, but uh, co going back to self-affirmations, guys, if you want to improve your, your confidence and everything, every single morning, put affirmations. I'll give you a couple examples, okay? So, uh, you know, I am confident. Uh, I am strong. Um, I don't know. Um, I protect my energy. I am confident. I am not afraid. Fear is not part of my being. You know, all types of words like that. Be creative. Think of different ways. But any type of word that you can actually add that will make you more confident. You know, I am confident. I am loved. I am, I am strong. I am um, I'm compassionate with people around me. Um, I love the interconnectedness between everything and everybody around me and i see it as a good thing because the more we work on ourselves with the interconnectedness with the domino effect i was talking a little earlier well it it's not just like a small domino it's not just like a small domino like it's like a really really long line of dominoes okay and you don't even see these dominoes by the way they just they just go around you know in the ether <laughs> and you don't even notice it and, and like you don't realize the power and the effect you have with the people around you you just don't understand and the more you work on yourself, you work on your confidence, you work on all of that. People around you are going to get inspired. They're going to love what they're seeing. They're going to want to have that aspect. They want to see that aspect in them as well. Right? And it's just a beautiful thing. Beautiful thing called growth. <laughs> and we all grow at different rates. But uh, I'm going to stop talking about because I'm drifting left and right and, and everything, right? I, I just love talking about stuff. And maybe that's, maybe I'm destined to, you know, to, to, to grow big on YouTube. Who knows? But I'm only here to help people to share my own experience and in the hopes that my own personal experience might help you guys, might help your own life. And that I hope that, that I, uh, you know that I can inspire people. I've already inspired a lot of different people all around me, and I've, I and I can see it. I can see it with my own two eyes, and that's what keeps me going. That's what keeps me going because if even if I help one person, I'm gonna be super happy because I'm gonna help at least a little bit. It might just be that first domino, right? And uh, that domino of healing. And it just sends ripple effect throughout the collective consciousness. And it's just a beautiful thing to see. So anyways, work on yourselves. Work on self-affirmations. Work on being strong, right? Work on being strong. Because the more solid you become, the more solid you become, your surroundings become more solid. Not solid in the sense, not, not like in the ego sense, in the sense that, oh, you're always on the defensive, like, oh, you lash out at everything. No, 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 no. Strong in your own frame of being strong in your own truth and you can feel all the energy and all of your spirit as you're walking you can feel your aura and nobody can mess with you anymore but once you do that you don't use that power in a bad sense you use that power to inspire other people around you in a good sense and improve their own lives and you can do that 
You just got to walk confidently, but not being arrogant. You don't want to become arrogant when you start to work on yourself and you become better. Right? People around you get inspired for sure, but that's why, that's why you don't want to become arrogant. Because then you just repel the energy for nothing. And, uh, you know, there's always that fine line between the two, right? <laughs> So yeah, my friends, so uh, yeah, I'm going to be remaking these videos on the chakras. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. This video has already been way too long, so I'm not going to uh, waste, well, not waste, but I'm not going to use uh, more of your time today. And I'm just sending you good vibes, good positivity your way, and work on yourselves. Because the better you improve yourself, the better you improve the world around you, the better you improve the world around you, the better we're going to get close to new earth new earth okay 5d the new age of love the new age of connection no divisiveness anymore there's going to be a lot of fights ahead for sure for the light and darkness battle for sure but you got to be remaining strong in your light and shine all that stuff all around you and let this beautiful earth that we actually live on right now get completely blessed with rays of truth Rays of love, rays of compassion, waves of healing. And then the collective consciousness can start to heal bit by bit with the domino effect as well and eventually reach prosperity. And we can do it, but you got to reach the inner prosperity first and your own vision. So please, guys, work on yourselves. Couple more videos coming up this week. Some older videos, remashing and everything. But stay strong. Stay yourself. And let the magic. Let the magic work its own flow throughout the universal consciousness. Stay blessed, my friends. Much love. Bye.